Hey there, I'm Andrea, Head of Growth and Co-Founder of Voxen, and today I want to show you the Thought Leadership Content Formula, also known as the principles that we follow at Voxen for our personal brand to decide what to write about and what content is going to resonate the most with our audience and is going to attract more leads, sales and new followers. So just to give you a little introduction about that, what is the purpose of this content formula? It's to provide a strategic approach to content creation. So anyone who wants to grow their influence through their personal brand should follow this formula in order to really have a strategic view on not only just writing content, but writing content that actually sells whatever you're going to sell if you're selling your thoughts, your expertise, or an actual physical digital product or service. So just getting a little bit of an overview on the usual challenge of content creation. So we all know that creating content is not a piece of cake. It can be tedious, time consuming, and required a dedicated portion of attention. This goes without saying that clearly decide what to write about every single time that you sit down and you want to decide a new piece of content to create. It's something that can take mental space and not be the easiest thing to do if you do it just randomly throughout your months or throughout your week. And clearly the following challenge is being consistent. You know that growth uh, through content uh, is a long-term game. It's one of the most rewarding things that you can do for your personal brand and for your company, if you run a company or you work for a company, but it clearly requires time, it requires consistency, and it's a snowball effect of positive outcomes that is just meant to happen if you show up consistently. So the importance of total leadership goes without saying. It's great because it's established it's helping you establishing credibility towards your audience. It just helps you building new connections and relationships at scale. And clearly this brings to a lot of long-term benefit, whether you're looking to sell something, whether you're looking to hire, or whether you just want to position yourself as a thought leader into a specific industry or a specific vertical. Let's dive directly into what is the thought leadership formula for us. And this is composed by four main elements, which we're gonna outline in a second. First of all, you want to write about topics you enjoy to write about. If you want to be consistent over in the long term, so you cannot escape from the fact that you need to like what you're writing about and uh, the benefits of writing something that you enjoy are clearly that, uh, you know, it fuels uh, the creation of authentic and engaging content that really is spoken from the heart. Um, ensures your sustained motivation to mission. So it's a, the byproduct of buying, of writing about something that you like is the fact that you're going to be more motivated to be consistent. And also it's tailored towards your unique voice. If you like what you write about, you will be more prone to write in a tone of voice that is yours, that is unique, and that long-term is going to resonate with your audience because of its authenticity. The second step is clearly that you want to find also something that solves your audience's problems. So you want really to dive deep into what are the problems of your audience and talk about something that is specifically for them. It helps increases the content relevance and usefulness, therefore engagement to your content. It clearly boosts the reader engagement and uh, it prompts them to take an action more frequently because clearly if you touch a nerve, uh, they're gonna more going to be more likely to engage and clearly if you provide a solution by talking to uh, talking about the problems you're going to build trust much more effectively and much more quicker then third you want to write about something that is at the same time your areas of strong expertise this is something that is very very important because you're going to establish a strong authority and credibility if you can share a lot about your personal expertise, your point of view, your direct experience, case studies, success stories, deep insights. This is something that clearly adds value, educates the audience and helps over the long term create a genuine relationship that people are going to, uh, that are, is going to make people trust you eventually. Then last but not least, an eye opening perspective. You want to try to add every time a perspective that is unique and that makes people think in a way that they never thought about this before. You want to introduce innovating ideas that capture the people's attention in a way that uh, 
if possible, as much times as possible, as many times as possible, it's not uh, the same type of, uh, let's say, input that you receive anywhere else. You want to position yourself as somebody who has a unique thought, whether it's a little bit controversial or contrarian or follows the general trend of thoughts about your in, in that, that exists in your industry. You want to give this unique eye-opening perspective that makes you be more positioned over the long term about a certain topic. So these are the main things. One of the bonus tips that I can give you uh, in order to make sure that you have a content production machine that goes uh, really, really smoothly and that it's uh, very easy to put in place is to actually break down all these four elements into topics and brainstorm what is the element of intersection that you have between these four topics. List out a list of elements and questions that you would like to answer in order to showcase your unique expertise about this topic and follow the methodology that we follow here at Voxen. If you get a content strategist or a person from your team or even just you know, a friend or somebody who is gonna, willing, gonna be willing to spend some time with you, jump on a call with them and ask them to interview you while you record this call and while you get uh, uh, to answer to these questions, you will provide your unique insights about the um, conversation. This is something that we usually uh, get help uh, from uh, a content matrix, which is something that I'm going to shoot a new video about very, very soon. But overall, if you get in a conversation, shoot content that looks genuine and authentic through a conversation, you would be surprised at how much easier it is for you to express your unique opinions and your unique point of views about the topic rather than just sitting in front of a camera and scripting content by yourself. From one hour of conversation, you will be able to create, if done properly, more than a hundred pieces of content without you even needing to think about it that much and without needing of a lot of preparation. Because again, if it's your expertise, this is the great way to do it. So I hope that this is helpful. I'm going to see you in the next video. We are preparing a lot of content that is educative around personal branding. If you want to hear about anything specific that you're interested in, I'm more than happy to give it a shot and create some content around it. I will talk to you soon. Thank you.